Hello, my name is Claudia and today I would like to show how to choose and to use the right syringe filter. Especially for HPLC sample preparation, a syringe filter is very important because dirty samples may block the column. There are many different syringe filters available. In the selection of the right syringe filter, certain things must be taken into consideration, such as sample amount, viscosity, pore size, membrane and the chemical resistance of the membrane. For samples smaller than 1 ml, a diameter of 3 mm is used. For 1 to 5 ml, 13 or 15 mm filters are used. And for 5 to 100 ml, 25 mm are suitable. If the sample is especially viscous, we recommend the usage of a lock connection. So that the syringe filter does not come loose during pressing. In general, the handling is quite simple. At first, you have to draw up the liquid into the syringe. Then the syringe filter put on and the sample is poured into a vessel or vial. Standard pore sizes are membranes with 0.45 micrometer and 0.2 micrometer. 0.45 micrometer are suitable for HPLC and 0.2 micrometer for UHPLC. Another important point is the choice of the right membrane depending on the sample and solvent. Use for aqueous solutions, for example cellulose, and for organic solvents polytetrafluoroethylene PTFE. Of great importance is also the chemical resistance of the filter and membrane. Various manufacturers provide resistance tables as shown here. If you are uncertain which syringe filter is the right one, please feel free to send an email or call.